Hey Sam here, welcome to the Vlidu uh, JV page. We're really excited about this software and I teamed up with Marius and Alex to launch this with them. This is a software that's unlike any of the other video softwares you've probably seen before and it's really professionally done. We've literally invested a good year into the development of this software and it looks great. You can create playlists like this, you can create new effects with your videos, you can embed them, the video player is fast and it's going to be at a great price for your customers with high scarcity throughout the launch so you've got every reason to promote this right from the start. All right, let's hop over to my computer. I want to show you how the software works and go down below to see all of the details on this JV page about the contest and how you can prepare the best promotion for this launch. Okay, so this is the Vlidu player right here. And you can see already on the dashboard, it looks clean, it looks nice. You can see where the views are coming from uh, and your customers will be able to check that out as well. This is a Vlidu account and it's gonna record all the views, the plays, and also a bunch of other information about email submits, how many times this has been embedded, and a whole lot of other information in there as well. This is a really complete player and it doesn't just include the ability to you know, host videos and add videos to your websites from all around the web, but it also gives you the ability to split test videos and also include video playlists like you see right here. So video playlists like these become possible with this player. It also has a bunch of other options that you can do over the video, over top of the video here, and it's playable on Facebook, and it's also got the ability to add advertisements into the player as well, making this uh, so much more valuable. So the playlists are really quite easy to use. We've got a list of playlists we've already added here, and when you want to use a playlist, you can do it through this system. This is the playlists system. Add a new playlist if you want to add a new one. Choose the playlist's name. Choose the channel, um, if you want channels, input, search input, so do you want to be able to search for different videos inside of playlists, and you want a default list type, which basically means a thumbnail um, for each of yours. You can even have it autoplay as well. Click save, and then it takes you to this menu right here. Now in this menu, you can add different channels, so we can add this channel right here, and it's gonna add this channel into our player. So you see here, we've got this, um, this up here, this is the channel, Games Trailers. That's the channel name. We've created a new channel here, and if we click Edit, we can actually go in and add videos to this particular channel. So we can add the videos here now into this category because we've set this up. And we click Display, 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 and we're building out our video playlist. This is perfect for websites that are music sites, any website that has multiple videos. You've seen the success that, you know, Websites like Vimeo have had. This creates the Vimeo effect inside of any website around the web, and you know it'll work on WordPress and on uh, you know what you're doing as well wherever. Okay, it'll work on HTML, uh, all of that. It's fully flexible and workable. When you're done, you click Save Changes. It's been saved. Then you can go across to Playlists. You can go List, and you can go across and actually embed your playlist either over um, you know a separate player. You could do it inside of your website or there's actually a script for um, you know, uh, WordPress as well. You can adjust the size as you want, really easy to set up. So this is one of the main selling points we think that um, Vlidu has over other softwares out there. I haven't seen a software that puts together such a complete playlist before and I think it'll be a really easy selling point for your customers as they go through this. The video setup is really easy as well. You simply add new video, You've got the opportunity then to add the title, description, the author. All of this is fully flexible. If you want, you can allow normal ads. You can actually go ahead and allow an ad at the beginning of your player. You've got the access information. You can restrict the age of the person visiting. You can go through, you can choose the file um, that you wanna grab. So you can use either Amazon S3, as you can see here, and search through our Amazon S3 buckets to find videos. We've got a connection uh, integration that happens through that really easily. Also, we've got the ability to go and grab videos from Google uh, Drive, Dropbox, and you can also directly add these in from YouTube if you really want as well. Now once you've selected your video, you click Add Source, click Next. Then we've got our static images. We can add a thumbnail to our videos as you'd expect. We can add captions. We can actually add a full transcript to our video. We can add opt-in forms, embed opt forms, skip buttons if we wanted to. We can force someone to act if we want to as well. So say for example, they have to share in order to watch the video, that's possible through this system. And if they want you know, to get access to the other part of the video, we could actually ask them to complete a particular action. Then we've got the ability to show ads, and this is where you're able to um, you know, basically have 
the ads images or URLs added into the system through the smart controls component right here. Now I've got through this system the ability to do split tests, it's really quite easy and it'll show you all the statistics so you can gain all the information you need as to which video is working over the other. And we've got a campaign section, so for whatever example you want to run multiple split tests, you want to see what's working really well and what's not, that's available here as well. You can preview all your videos if you want to do that, and also the integration is very generous in terms of um, the different websites that it works with, so we can upgrade, obviously add our details from Amazon, Google Drive, Dropbox, or uh, any autoresponder. Um, that you can think of, it's really flexible, and we've also got the ability to integrate with APIs for different autoresponders as well, for the call to actions over the video. So the player, as you can see, is a very flexible player, it has a lot of features, and there's a lot that this player has which hasn't come out in the past with any other video player. So we really feel this is a great tool to add to your customer's toolbox. So we encourage you to get on board. If you're on this page right now, you're watching this video, you 